you. Although the best place to beat the heat seems like the water, we have a story about drowning dangers in Avon Lake. News Channel 5's Paul Kiska joins us live where, Paul, there have been several drownings in the last couple of years. Well, that's rightly, and as you said, this extremely hot weather really brings out the beachgoers. That's Huntington Beach here in Bay Village across the street from me. It's packed. The parking lot is filled, so we're across the street in the overflow parking lot to set up for this. Unfortunately, they had a drowning here less than two weeks ago. That was because of riptides, strong winds, strong waves. But what's happening further down the lakeshore in Avon Lake in calm water, a much different situation. Despite danger signs, this guy is standing, fishing right in and around where seven people drowned in 15 years. A 23-year-old man drowned Wednesday while fishing. He fell off that ledge into a strong current. While most people here swim and fish in the public beach near Avon Lakes Miller Park, others venture into knee-deep water kept warm by water being discharged from the nearby power plant. The warm water attracts schools of fish, enticing fishermen and swimmers. Some who died here were just ages 8, 13, and 15. It's sad that even one fatality would occur. And there's really no need to go way down by the power plant over there uh, where the currents are rougher. There's a sign, so if you go beyond that point, it drops off pretty significantly. Not only is the calm roped off, knee deep water hiding an extremely strong current, the water drops off without warning. Avon Lakes Mayor Greg Zilka urging people to heed the warning signs, one of which is the warm water itself. The water coming out of that area is very warm and it's very enticing. It's almost like a bath and the closer you get to the danger, the warmer it gets and it, it sort of uh, invites people into that area. Even experienced swimmers have problems handling the situation. All right, back live here tonight and uh, Mayor Zilka says these drownings bring back uh, bad memories for him. When he was a child swimming with his father in Vermilion where he was growing up, his father drowned right in front of him. He's asking everyone to be careful, especially there in Avon Lake. What makes it tricky, even though it's roped off, it starts as shallow water and drops off and strong currents. Live in Bay Village tonight, Paul Kiska, News Channel 5. Paul, really good point that it's so important not to take these things for granted, even if you think you're very familiar with an area and you've got to watch those warnings that are posted. So truly, especially being out there today in person, I really see what the problem is. Even though the city and the, the power plant have done a good job with all the signs, the water starts off as shallow and drops off, and the current coming out of the power plant, extremely vicious.